What is going on guys? Stuck under 44 here today back with another video now, guys as you all know everyone must know this news today Nintendo just announced the Nintendo switch Light. And now it's pretty crazy that yesterday I did an unboxing video of the Nintendo DS Lite. That was not on purpose, but hey, I guess that happened. We are now on Nintendo Switch Lite, which is honestly really cool to see that Nintendo actually did this. I mean, there's been so many rumors on this topic about the Nintendo Switch Mini, the Nintendo Switch Pro. I mean, literally endless, endless endless conversation about what is Nintendo going to do, are they going to come out with an updated version of this console, I mean because they really don't need to, but they did anyways and I think it's really good what they did, I think it's really good what they came out with. Now, for someone like me who loves Nintendo so much and collects like the consoles and stuff, I'm in big trouble, okay, because Nintendo just opened up a huge, huge market for collector's editions and special editions for the Nintendo Switch now. They were waiting for this console, the Nintendo Switch Lite, to do collector's edition stuff because the price point is perfect. $199 is literally the best thing Nintendo has ever done. Now, younger kids that don't have a Switch yet because the price point was too high and the parents were like, oh, I'm not spending $300 on that when, you know, the, the DS is around. You can get the DS, the 2DS for, what, 80 bucks? You can get the, the 2DS XL for 150 and then the 3DS XL, of course, for uh, 199 But now I wonder now if that's going to drop too as well because the Switch Mint, the Switch, sorry, I keep saying Switch Mini because it's really like a Switch Mini, but they decided to call it the Switch Lite because I think they want to continue what they're doing like they did in the past, the DS Lite and all the different lights they've had in the past. Um, but yeah, the Switch Lite is now 199 so it's like, What's the DS? What's the 3DS going to be? Is it going to stay the same? Is it going to go away? And I, I was looking on Twitter today and it seems like Nintendo is sticking around with the 3DS, which I mean, I'm happy about. I like the 3DS. I played. I haven't played it in a while, of course, because all I've been doing is playing the Switch. Um, but this is really, really cool. And there's literally so much to talk about. I kind of want to break it up into videos, but I kind of want to get everything that like I want to like let you guys know and kind of my thoughts on everything from this. I was talking back and forth with time lag on Twitter today and the first thing I thought of when I saw the picture of the Switch Lite was themes because I saw that background on the, I'll put it up on the screen, the background of the contract there. But then he also pointed out when the Nintendo Switch was launching it kind of had the same little design going on. So I don't think we're going to be getting themes quite yet but we need them. We definitely need them. And <laughs> another thing, oh my gosh, that Pokemon Special Edition that they have coming out. Oh my gosh, when is that going on pre-order because I have to pick that up and personally I'm probably gonna pick up all three colors that they came out with the turquoise is definitely my favorite by the way Cop the merch link down below. This is the newest merch. It's it's fire. Okay, it's fire um, Sorry, I'm getting off topic a break cop the newest duck merch down below This is the duck X llama as you can see creator code duck 144 on the back. Oh, oh It's looking snazzy you can get these in all different colors hoodies shirts whatever you need get it down below <laughs> While supplies last up. I'm really excited to see what Nintendo's doing It's really cool to see because now younger kids that don't have a switch yet now they can get a switch It's not as breakable and it it's just, it's just, the price point is perfect. The price point is literally perfect. And they can play most every Nintendo Switch game that's out there besides ones where you have to take off the Joy-Cons and use, which is gonna get a little confusing at times. I hope they're probably gonna start to put that on the packaging um, of like the cartridges and stuff, of the boxes of course, um, saying if it's for the Switch Lite or if it's not compatible with the Switch Lite or if it is. Um, so we're probably gonna be seeing that soon. But man, thinking about this too. We got Animal Crossing coming out next year, right? The special edition consoles that are going to be coming out for this, guys. Oh my gosh. I'm literally, it's literally going to be the, the Nintendo DS generation all over again on the Nintendo Switch platform. Like, I'm literally going to have so many collector's editions of this console. It's going to be insane. Like, I've already had, uh, I just, oh, this is bad. At least the price point's better. At least I'm not going to be spending... $300 every time a collector edition comes out, but the collector editions we've seen anyways have been around 350 to $400, so 
It's looking a little bit better in our favor with the switch light. And honestly, I love the design. I think the size is gonna be just right. It's about like the PS Vita size. So it, everything just looks so good and I'm just so excited to get my hands on one. Nintendo, I hope you're sending them to ambassadors like at least a week early so we can, not probably not a week early, but like at least a little bit early. I, I hope, please. I would, I would love it. Um, but besides that, I'm just super excited. I want to know your guys' thoughts down below in the comments. Do you like the Switch Lite? Do you not like it? Are you going to get it? Are you not going to get it? Because personally, I feel people that have the Nintendo Switch right now that aren't like collectors don't need this at all. I really don't think they need it at all. But I think it's smart that Nintendo did this because the price point is absolutely perfect for the people that couldn't afford the $300. The, the $300. Um, Price point is, is spot on. Like, Nintendo's gonna kill it with that. They're gonna sell so many of these in the holiday season because that's all kids are gonna want is a Nintendo Switch Lite. Durable, price point is right. You don't have to deal with the, the Joy-Cons. You don't have to deal with anything and it's portable and you can take it wherever you want and it's smaller and it's just, it's, it's perfect. Nintendo, Great job, you guys absolutely killed it. I'm excited to see what else you do and whether collector editions come out. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. So guys, let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. So like and comment down below. Smack that subscribe button if you are new. Thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you on the next one. Peace out!